This is the big finale of the picture. It'll only cost about a million dollars, but it'll give the picture real class. Lots of size, you know. People love size in the musicals. Well, in the beginning, it's very small, but by the finish, it's an avalanche. Absolutely overwhelming. that music? That's orphan music. Well, it starts in an orphan's home, and I'm an orphan. It's all unspeakably drab. Well, there I am scrubbing away at a wash tub, unattractive, unloved, unwanted, and also feeling very sorry for myself, when suddenly I look up in the sky like Joan of Arc seeing her vision, and I too see a vision. So I break out into glorious song. Someday there's a someone who's a someone for me. Someday there will come one and my lover he will be. I sound like Shirley Booth. Someday you will know him from the moment he's in view. And he'll know affection he's never known hitherto. Now I become two people, the real me and the dreamer me. It's quite schizophrenic. I pay no mind to the waiting. Let the clock tick tock all day. The dream I'm contemplating will be here to stay. Now there's a struggle between the real me and the dreamer me. Gets even more schizophrenic. Somewhere there's a someone for me. Go and find them. And whether by land or across the sea. Go and find them. I'll be searching. Go and find them. Searching. And go out and find him. The ready. Well, the dreamer me wins. So while the real me stays at the washtub, it's still very drab. The dreamer me gets up and goes to find him, searching, searching everywhere. There is mist and fog <coughs> and smokiness and the music of harps. And the voices of angels beckoning to me, come on and find him, come on and find him, come on and find him. And I, I keep searching, searching, searching. And suddenly, I'm in Paris, France, on top of the Eiffel Tower. I, I searched there for a while. Nothing. So I'm on. And I'm walking. Still searching, mind you. Well, I've walked to Montmartre. To the Folie Bergère. Pathetic and forlorn stands there. It's Edith Piaf. And she sings in her own inimitable way. 
the eternal tragedy of woman. Woman. We love. Where's the man? For moi. For me. Sans moi. Without my man. Ce n'est pas de joie. She ain't living. But the fog comes up again, and Paris, France, disappears, vanishes. Who needs it? It's all cherry blossoms, gouda's, lanterns, and kimonos. This is Japan, and I am Madame Butterfly. Still searching, mind you. And here we do. The Oriental bed, which I love. Somewhere I will meet him. Somewhere, somewhere I will meet him. Nowhere. Bang, bang. Now we must leave Japan, because I must go on searching, seeking. And out of the mist, or the fog, or the smoke, it becomes. Oh, don't tell me. Oh, it's the jungle. The deep, dark, mysterious jungle. And guess what I'm doing? I'm searching. 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 And you do the jungle bed. So in the jungle, I found King Solomon's mines, the African Queen, and Mogambo. But that ain't what I'm searching for. So I move on. I move. I move on. I, I, I'm moving. I, I'm moving on. <laughs> Russia. Yes. Sweden. Ah, it's Brazil, Carioca. Vale. Oh, salad bed, salad bed. Now all this time, the real me is still back at the orphan's home, at the wash tub, and still very drowsy. Comes the war, and cannons fire. She throws a pillow, and bombs burst. Throws pillow, he throws pillow back. She throws one more pillow, and the dreamer in me becomes a Red Cross nurse, and she's wiped out in the Battle of the Budge. Jumps up suddenly, but the real me, the washed-up me, has finally realized she's been missing an absolute ball. So she kicks over the washed-up and starts singing the finale. But but、uh, they worked this out for a big, terrific shot, the finish shot, where the camera zooms up to this tremendous close-up of me, just as she starts into the finale. <laughs> I've searched. And I've searched, I've stumbled, and I've lurched across the land and the sea. I've looked around, and I've finally found the someone. 